Right, good afternoon, good afternoon. Welcome to Pat and Lee Sports and Health TV. I just want to talk a little bit about what we, we did. We've done a live show um, yesterday and uh, we spoke about the Eddie Hall for Beyonce and Fight out in, the, out in Dubai. And I was listening to um, Talk Sport this morning and they actually mentioned it on there. Simon Jordan and um, um, what's his name? Uh, Jim White. And. Um, they actually had Richard Schaefer on the show this morning, the, the promoter, and they were talking about, and they sort of agreed with us about, you know, this what's it, what's it coming to? This when we've got YouTubers and celebrities fighting, it's it's not really something that um, you want to see, and it, it's not fair on, on other fighters. In my opinion, that, that they get up six o'clock every morning, even when they're not fighting, to train to keep sharp. And then step up their training when they have got a fight coming on, and it's a lifestyle for them. And to have these uh, people just come out of the blue and and win and have fights and win loads of money is, you know, it doesn't seem quite fair. But the interesting thing is as well, um, I was uh, I remember a little while ago there was um, a fight uh, Julio Cesar Martinez, and he's under Eddie Hearn. Eddie Hearn did come on the show as well. And he fought uh, a guy called um, uh, Charlie Edwards uh, as a flyweight. It was a flyweight title. And uh, he, he knocked out Charlie Edwards, but he hit him while he was on the floor. It was ruled as a no contest. So when that happened, um, Charlie was stepped up in weight and Martinez fought for the vacant title and won it. But hear this. There is uh, Charlie Edwards' brother, Sonny Edwards, from Croydon. He's he's uh, he's also under Richard Schaefer, uh, and uh, they was mentioning of a fight, a possible fight between Martinez and Sonny Edwards uh, on the show. Uh, Eddie Earn and and um, Richard Schaefer were talking about Jim White was trying to instigate it, and I think you know what, that would be. There's a lot of backstory there as well with the fight with the brother beforehand, and I think that'd be a good fight. It's going to be built as a you know it's it's a good thing that the the, the the lighter weights, like these are flyweights, and it's a good thing that the, the lighter weights are getting into the spotlight a little bit as well. So it's not all always dominated about the middle, you know, the middleweight, heavyweight, super middleweights, welterweights, and it was, you don't really, you know, you ain't heard a lot with the, the, the really the lighter weights further down, you know, the, uh, the nine stone, eight stone and a half guys. The featherweights and that we used to bantams and these are flyweights and um the the the, the best fight with flyweight I can I can remember in my lifetime was Charlie Magri and I think you know Sonny Edwards is from Croydon I think you know he's he might be the next thing he might be the next big thing let me know what you think. I think I'm, I'm quite intrigued to find out if this fight's going to happen. I'm quite intrigued to to look into his career because I really don't know much about him. But I'd like to find out more. If you know anything, put a message down in the comments. But it's just something I want to do a quick little video on. I think I'm going to speak to Pat and we might do a live show on it. So um, keep them peeled and watch out for our notifications. Press like on the channel, subscribe. And you get loads of content, boxing, football, health, everything. God bless. Take care.